How many married people in here? Let me see your hands if you're married. Look, all over the audience, married people. Hey, look around. Someday you're going to be like this. <laughs> this has happened to a lot of married couples. I bet you it's happened to a lot of the people who raise their hands. I'm sound asleep. It must be midnight, one o'clock. I am awakened out of a sound sleep to hear this sound, the sound of my dear sweet wife's voice. Listen. That will wake you up. <laughs> My eyeballs are bugging out. I'm waiting for the ax to fall. I'm waiting for the gun to go off. I turn to her and I try to inquire. What? She went, shh. <laughs> it's in the garage. <laughs> She's grabbing a hold of my arm, shutting all the blood off tomorrow. I tried to inquire. I said, what? She went, <laughs> what if he's escaped from somewhere? <laughs> I tried to inquire. I said, what? She went, <laughs> what if he's got a chainsaw? <laughs> what if he's a Democrat? You know, just... <laughs> I love, I, I love doing that. <laughs> she never said that. <laughs> but I love doing that because I can spot every Democrat in the audience. <laughs> she said, what if, what if he has a chainsaw? And then with a violent little shove, <laughs> this is the truth, she went, go see. <laughs> Excuse me, love of my life. Let me see if I have this straight. I know, I know. You think someone's in the garage. Yes, he's in the garage, he's in the garage. Okay. You think he has escaped from somewhere. Yes, he has escaped. What if you had to escape? <clears throat> okay. You are fairly certain that he has a chainsaw. <laughs> yes, he has a chainsaw. A chainsaw. <laughs> and you want me <laughs> to confront him <laughs> in my fruit of the loom. So have, I got, have I got this right? <laughs> How effective can I possibly be? <laughs> hey, hey, you with a chainsaw! Get out of here! Snap!